Hey, what's up, YouTube? Wanted to make a quick video about an overheat issue I was having with the Subaru. On highways, it would overheat about 11 miles in or so, and then it would temperature gauge would start climbing, and you'd turn the heater on and let some of the hot air in the cabin, and it would go down and replace the temp sensor and. That didn't fix it, it looked pretty pretty bad, so decided to go see if the radiator had an issue. And pulling the radiator out, you can see all the chunks of debris that came out of the radiator. I had done a flush on this too with Blue Devil and drove it up the up the highway with the Blue Devil in it for about 10 minutes and it's still overheated. So brought it back, pulled the radiator out. I'll show you what the radiator looks like. This is the front side of the radiator that goes towards the cold air as you're driving and if you can see it is just caked caked with dirt dust and road debris and this was causing air not to be able to get through the radiator and cool the engine if you look at the back it's clear front side caked so if you guys have any Subarus or any other vehicle that overheats when you're going down the highway but doesn't overheat when you're in traffic just driving around or sitting at an idle be sure to check your radiator over time of not doing radiator flushes gunk and rust gets built up in there and doesn't let it flow well, I just thought I'd make this quick video to hope it helps you all out. I spent a few days diagnosing this and that's what I found. Alright, until next time.